probably we started in 2007 and right after that we landed Hayward Field, the track and field trials in 2008 and that was huge. Uh, all of a sudden we went from having a few small accounts um, in the evening once or twice a week to we need to hire 30 people now and we need to have them train for this one week event but it was it was so great to have the pride in being such a part of the community and and it, it was nice that was my favorite there's the difficulty of keeping up with 12,000 people in the building and all the uh, the things that they cause in terms of spills of popcorn soda ice cream you know you name it um, you know, it's really truly about establishing standards and trying to meet those standards. And Janet King has worked with us to develop those standards and then really has worked really hard in trying to keep up with them um, under the direction of uh, Michelle Powell. She's done a great job in, you know, making sure her staff is constantly moving and constantly, you know, keeping up with spills. You know, we call spills in, but half the time they're beating us to the punch as they're constantly patrolling the concourses and the restrooms. And uh, I'm really happy with, with what the end result has been, which is, you know, for the most part, if you walk in the building and you're the first person in, that's what the building looks like. You know, at halftime, that's what the building looks like. You know, halfway through, you know, the second half, uh, that's really the goal, is that the place looks clean all the time.